Why, hello lovely people YouTube and welcome. At the moment you can probably just see my screen recorder, so let's click that off. This video is essentially going to explain how you, well, install the modification Zero Hour Reborn, which is a mod that I have played in the past. Summary of this, let me just have a little read it. It's originally one of the oldest mods for Zero Hour, but it's an absolutely fantastic mod, and it changes up all the generals and makes the game a bit of a funny meme, and you will like it in quite a lot, I can guarantee you that. Yeah, let's have a look. What you want is Zero Hour Reborn version 6.26, because I'm obviously going to be playing with the most recent version. At the moment, I think they are working on a mixture of other mods, such as Shockwave, Chaos. But I do believe they are planning on coming back to this at one point, to add the Russia faction. Because who doesn't want Mother Russia to play us? But essentially, you can see like some of the change log here, all the different generals that you've got av available to play as. And what you want to do is download it. I've already downloaded it, so I'm not going to persist and download it again, because there was zero point. And essentially, it's only 332 megabytes. Unless you literally have a potato as your internet, you're going to be fine to download it. Save that to your download file or whatnot. And what I'll do is, what we'll do is scrounge all the way over to my downloads. And the easiest way to do this, in general, before you even pop into downloads, or anything, you think, and go get that zero hour reborn file, the easiest things you can do, for example, my IFLE Origin game client. client and I bought my Zero Hour off Amazon. But essentially I bought it so it's just a digital copy. That installs through this game client Origin. That's why all my videos are like Origin installation. Because it is different for... For example if you're doing this on a disc. It would be a very very similar format. But your files just might be in a slightly different place on your computer. But what you want to do is literally... Go into Programs Times 86. If you have this on Origin. I'm going to go Origin Games. I can see Command and Conquer Zero Hour, and I'll be a bit slow about this, so you can see this PC local disk. This is where mine is. Yours might be slightly different, but this is where mine is. But generally, as a rule of thumb, your program's 86 files has most of your games available in there. And you can see Command and Conquer General Zero Hour, and you want to double left click that. And what you want to do is double left click this just to check it's the right folder, and this is what I want. It is this big folder, so it's this folder. Let me just pop back out. So it's this one you want. You want the folder that contains all your stuff like data, core, MNS, and all, um, stuff like that. Well, MSS. And what you want to do is, I just pop it in my documents tree and just paste it, plop, plop, plop it in there, because I've already done this, and this is it. And pop it in your documents. This will literally let you, instead of having, if you, a mod goes wrong, or you want to switch in between out of mods very, very quickly, you could just literally uh, copy this back into that file and just delete the old AR uh, data set, which is in your origin file. And I'll explain how you do that anyway, and how I would do it, for example. But essentially, yeah, make sure you have a copy of this, because it's just going to make your life easier in the future. And what you want to do is go to my Magical Downloads uh, section now, which is a fucking mess. Let's go to Download, Zero Hour Reborn, version 626. Dot. And essentially you want something like WinZip or 7-Zip. But I can just open this archive, and that is fine. So let's open a archive. And it's got all the files here which are big installation files which essentially just, that's just like the game data got a change log we got the install little uh, I didn't really want to click that but there you go that's just the thumbnail for zero hour reborn and we got the readme file readme files are very important because they virtually will explain how to install a mod make a copy of your zero hour folder that's the one we've just done and I do that anyway for all my mods because it's just so much easier and delete the data slash scripts folder inside the copy so what we are going to do is go back into Programs 86. We're going to go back to Origin Games, back to Zero Hour. You should have already made a copy of this by now. And you want to go Data, Scripts. And you just literally want to go Control A and you want to delete all that. Then what you want to do is jump back to my Downloads. Go on Zero Hour Reborn, Omni 7 Zip, Open Archive. And we want to select all this. We want to extract this to the local disk. Programs 86. I think you can see where this is going. Origin Games. Zero Hour. Zero Hour main folder. Data. And you can see the scripts folder there. And pop that in there. And it should only take a few seconds actually to pop that in. Then it's the big test to see 
If I pop loads in the right place, let's go local disk, blah, 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 origin games. Data, scripts, everything's there. That's what it should look like. So your data should file, movie should have a little intro in there. And you've got all the reborn files, the main files and everything. And what you can just do now, and hopefully this should work because I've already tested this out once. It's run admin, admin, which I do anyway, just so it gets past any like security things and you just want to load up zero hour. So let's do that. So our reborn, that's, well, see our normal generals loading screen, that's fine at the moment. So our arrow reborn, this is looking promising. And to make sure this is working essentially, we're just going to go, obviously you can see it's our arrow reborn, we want to go skirmish. Let's just play as someone completely mad. But as you can see, there's a number of frowny looking general names here, which I'm going to stay the fuck away from. But, but I've made it, I've, this video, I played this before. Granted, the audio qualities are a bit potato quality when I played this before, but. Yeah, essentially, you, you want a general that just, just, for example, where I just play against GOA Terror. Well, I just, I'm just demonetized now, but it doesn't matter. Alpine Assault. You say Rogue General, let's play this. This mod is a meme essentially, and you should be over here. So let's just use a scan, let's just check the AI is playing. And as you can see, obviously the scripts are installed in the correct place as this GLA frowny, frowny general is actually building things. So as you can see, this is how you install Zero Hour Be Born, at least if you are using an Origin game client, but if you're got it on anything else such as a disc copy or whatnot it will be a very very similar process it will not differ much from what i'm doing i'm not an expert i don't make any mods or anything like that and i have no intention of making any mods in the future i have no plans on i just love playing mods and i love reviewing them and also giving the creator of the mod as much praise as possible for example zero hour reborn is a really fun mod and i do recommend you go play it hope that helps you all if you enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. If you didn't find this helpful, feel free to leave a dislike or possibly a positive or negative comment. And also, I've only recently set it up. I now have a Patreon going, so if you want a few exclusive goodies that you can get by becoming a Patreon, you can welcome have to check, uh, check on my Sarcastic Raptor Patreon page. Where we have several little at tiers there, such as Salt Miner, we got our uh, Salty Sergeant, and we also got a General Condiment our uh, was it general i've essentially based my tears because how i get so salty when i'm playing i know i'm completely going on a tangent but i get so salty when i play commander conquer and strategy games that i've just been nicknamed uh, salty raptor slash salty scott so i've no issues with that name whatsoever but anyways if you enjoyed this feel free to leave a like dislike check out patreon but apart from that have a great day and i will see you in the next video